New tonight, cars crashing into a wall at an Osceola County apartment complex. People living there say it happens way too often. Check out the damage from just one of those crashes on Point Sienna Boulevard. The sheriff's office says it's already happened multiple times this year alone. It's all new at 6. Investigator Lewis Bolton went to Osceola County to get results and find out if anything is being done to stop this. Residents say this wall has been repaired numerous times. We pulled the stats and found crashes into this wall have hit double digits year after year. This picture says it all about the wall outside Edomiro Torres' apartment. It's a growing problem that's, that has me worried. Worried because he has seen it happen over and over. They come speeding through that curve and they lose control and end up crashing into our wall here. According to the Osceola County Sheriff's Office, this year alone there have been 17 accidents, hit and runs, and reckless driving incidents at this wall. Take a look at this photo where a car didn't hit the wall but hit the water pump instead. It left us without uh, water service for uh, a couple of hours. They were able to come in and fix it on a Friday afternoon mm -hmm. or otherwise we would have been all weekend without water. And take a look at the dent in this car from a flying cinder block after someone again crashed into the wall. The driver was badly injured. It's Raywadi Kochi's vehicle. She agrees something needs to be done. I think they need to put a sign or a light there mm -hmm. that definitely to let them know the driver slowed down. News 6 took that suggestion right to county leaders. We weren't aware of this until we were contacted by the station. Osceola County Public Relations Officer Mark Pino says the county is now taking action. We uh, have the traffic data and we'll look at that and see what, what is the best solution if, it, if it's signage or, or some other measure to calm traffic. Eventually someone will be killed or they will kill themselves against this wall. It'd be disgraceful for something like that to happen. We're going to monitor this situation in Osceola County and help residents get results. In Osceola County, I'm Lewis Bolden, News 6.